um, if they were a member, they got moved to the front of the line. So if they called in on a, you know, Tuesday at nine um, and they wanted someone out still that morning or early afternoon, they got moved in front of anybody else that's not a member. And from a time standpoint, which we say all the time, Mrs. Jones just wants her day back. So if you can give her that peace of mind that she can dictate when the, when the plumber comes out and that she's not waiting all day or, or whatever, that all day long, mm -hmm. especially for busy Mrs. Joneses. Hey, hey, plumbing pros, welcome to the 363rd episode of Potty Talk Live. I'm your host, Richard Bainey, the Million Dollar Plumber, along with my co-host, the lovely Laura, where we're talking the business of plumbing, how to systemize, stylize, and most importantly, monetize your plumbing business. <laughs> And that's what we're going to be talking about in this episode of Potty Talk, mm -hmm. where we're going to talk about maintenance agreements that sell. Okay. Okay. And how does that help you monetize your plumbing business? So okay. we're going to get into that. All mm -hmm. right. It's important. Okay. I know. All right. Hey, before we get into that, though, mm -hmm. I do want to thank our sponsor. Okay. Mention our sponsor here. Mm -hmm. You know, every call is an opportunity for your plumbing business. That ain't that the truth. All right. Mm -hmm. Stop missing those opportunities with Plumline. Plumline is a 24-7, 365 days a year answering service exclusively for professional plumbing companies. Founded by a plumbing business owner, Plumline understands the importance of booking every job opportunity. Plumline CSRs book jobs directly into your booking software so you don't have to, leaving you to do what you do best. And what is that? Mm -hmm. Taking care of Mrs. Jones. That's right. Whether you're just starting out, especially if you're still in the truck or a seasoned residential service plumbing business, Plumline is a no-brainer. Go from surviving to thriving. Never miss an opportunity again. Sign up with Plumline today. Go to themilliondollarplumber.com forward slash Plumline and mention that you are a Potty Talk listener for priority onboarding. That's themilliondollarplumber.com forward slash plumb line okay. and plumb like a champion. Okay. All right. They help you love, do just that. Love plumb line. Yeah, we love plumb line. Mm -hmm. All right. Okay. All right. Hey, we also love maintenance agreements. We love them. And maintenance agreements that sell. Okay. Well, you know, mm -hmm. a lot of times we, we see this with our clients, you know, we, we get caught up, well, we got to have a maintenance agreement and we just get, uh, you know, all well, caught up in too complicated you know, or make, make it all complicated mm -hmm. and, and we, we think it, uh, it's about the maintenance agreement, mm -hmm. all right? Maintenance agreements aren't about the maintenance agreement, mm -hmm. all right? There's, there's a concept there. <laughs> Have you heard that concept? <laughs> it ain't about plumbing, <laughs> all right? The same thing goes with maintenance agreements. So, so what are maintenance agreements okay. really about? And yeah, what should they be about? Okay. Mm -hmm. Well, first of all, really what your maintenance agreement is, okay, it's a sales tool, okay? It really is a sales tool to help you on that initial an initial sell. Mm -hmm. Okay. So, you know, for example, um, you know, with, with your, with your uh, maintenance agreement, you know, it's kind, of, it's kind of a membership. You're going to have something in there such as probably like um, um, reduced prices, sure. you know, like discounted rates, discount, mm -hmm. discounted rates for something above and beyond for, what you might offer in other areas. Right. Ex right? Exactly. Mm -hmm. So that, that comes to, uh, in, into play uh, on that, you know, your first, you know, doing this, the sell or the sale. Mm -hmm. All right. Or uh, for the repair, so in that you're going to be you're going to they're going to see that um, you know that that the that this job or task cost you know X okay maybe you know five hundred dollars just to use an example okay but for members all right it's four hundred dollars mm -hmm. all right and they'll see that so how, how do I become a member mm -hmm. well those are those that are on our maintenance agreement well tell right? me more tell me more exactly okay <laughs> so the, the maintenance agreement is is not about and most people aren't really all about they, they are but that's not a primary Aren't about sorry about and thank you um <laughs> about the maintenance of the equipment that's right. really not there's few people mm -hmm. you know that are really into they want all the coverage mm -hmm. okay right um but what they are into at the moment savings savings mm -hmm. right and if the bonus is that i'm also getting stuff checked out and agree okay that's cool right but that's cherry on top but the main thing is how can you save me, me money. money? Save me more money. More money, more money. All right. Money. So that that's really what a maintenance agreement is. Mm -hmm. Okay. So there's a little bit of a mind shift there. Mm -hmm. All right. That, you know, we see that with, with our clients. So trying to get that idea across. It's not, maintenance agreements aren't a maintenance agreement. You know, the point is not to take care of the equipment. Mm -hmm. Even okay. though that's what you do. That's what you do. Right. right. Even though that's, yeah. But main, that's not really. That's not the main thing. Right. Mm -hmm. All right. A maintenance agreement really is a sales tool. A sales tool. Sales tool. A sales yes. tool. All right. Okay? Mm -hmm. Which also leads to another very important point. Mm -hmm. Maintenance agreement is for repeat 
sales opportunity. Absolutely. Okay. Mm -hmm. So we mentioned we're going to maintain that equipment. Correct. Okay. That water heater or whatever, you know. Okay. Mm -hmm. And Uh, and they have a membership now. They have a membership Mm -hmm. then. So include that membership is not only a discount, Mm -hmm. but then we're going to come in, you know, twice a year. I, you know, we did it twice a year. Right. Mm-hmm. And and flush of water here. It's not a matter, you know, you say, well, it should only be one once a year. I'm only going to go on free to, you know, once a year, to drain and flush their water heater. No, <laughs> I want to, I want to be in their house as many times as I can. That's right. Okay. Mm-hmm. Check so, out their plumbing, check different areas of their plumbing. And not only just to sell right. them something where we don't want to sell Mrs. Jones something that she doesn't need, but, but you're the expert that she now is rely that she now relies on to take care of her plumbing. So you're going in and checking out all of her mechanicals, um, checking out, making sure that there's no leaks anywhere, all the things. um, And that will give her peace of mind. Exactly. Mm -hmm. You know, the the maintenance agreement just, you know, it's it's a relationship. You know, Mm -hmm. we want, we want to keep this relationship. Mm -hmm. And so you have a relationship with your customer as long as she has plumbing. Yes. And pretty sure she's always going to have plumbing. So, so, you know, again, it's, it's a repeat sales opportunity. So Mm -hmm. we can get back in the house twice a year. Mm -hmm. There's an opportunity to find something, right? Okay, mm-hmm. at, you know, um, at a minimum, we're maintaining that relationship. Correct, and right, and you're you're going through the house and you're you're checking things out and you're checking again her me- her mechanicals. Is there anything leaking? All the things, and you're going to report back to her what your findings are. It's not going to be a hard push sale. You know, don't come at her with scare tactics or anything like that. Right, but let her know what's going on. Let her know what's going on with her water softener, her water heater, her sump pump, you know, all the things and shut off valves, obviously I means shut off valves are a huge thing to, to check all the time because as plumbers, you, you know, it can happen when the shut off valve isn't working correctly. Right. right? So frozen, that kind of thing. Mm-hmm. So, all right, it's a great, uh, you're speaking from experience. I know what you're <laughs> bringing that stuff up because that, that's exactly what we did. Mm-hmm. You know, our, our program, we called it the Attaboy. That Attaboy was, Assurance Program. Attaboy Assurance, not insurance. No, I assurance. You, right, I, I, I get you in a lot of yeah, no, trouble. Yeah, no insurance. Don't, <laughs> right, don't, don't, use, don't, the don't insurance. use the word insurance. Don't use the word insurance. But assurance, Correct. Attaboy Assurance Program. Mm-hmm. Okay, so part of it, we got a discount. They got our mm-hmm. best discount of uh, 15% friend, you know, discount. Mm-hmm. Um, then you got us in with a twice a year water heater mm-hmm. um, inspection and flush. Yep. Mm-hmm. Okay. And then also a whole house plumbing inspection Correct. twice a year. And priority scheduling. And so if they were a member, I don't know if you were going to talk about that or not uh, at all, but um, if they were a member, they got moved to the front of the line. So if they called in on a, you know, Tuesday at nine um, and they wanted someone out still that morning or early afternoon, they got moved in front of anybody else that's not a member. And from a time standpoint, which we say all the time, Mrs. Jones just wants her day back. So if you can give her that peace of mind that she can dictate when the, when the plumber comes out and that she's not waiting all day or, or whatever, that all day long, mm-hmm. especially for busy Mrs. Joneses. In fact, you're mentioning what we had in ours, so we might as well finish it out mm-hmm. and I'll finish the point on the repeat sales. Mm-hmm. It's, you know, we, we had the, um, the discount, mm-hmm. all right? We had the um, twice- Twice a year, um, water heater flush. Mm-hmm. All right. Yep. And inspection. Mm-hmm. And then we had the twice a year a whole, along with that, the whole house inspection. Mm-hmm. Okay. And I'll come, I'm going to come back to that Okay, because that's the sales opportunity. Right. All right. Mm-hmm. Whole house inspection. Mm-hmm. Um, then, then we had the, the priority service. Correct. Okay. Mm-hmm. Um, VI, you know, front of the line. So if your members, you know, come up, you know, that they come up, that they get priority. Yep. Move ahead. They're, they get their time. It's like slot. the fast pass at um, right. Disney World. Right. Right. Or right. universal, right? You pay for that. So you move right up to the front. So even if, you know, and, and, and you know, we talk about, you've heard us talk about, we talk about triaging jobs and that kind of stuff. That's mm-hmm. what does come into play mm-hmm. that uh, Mrs. Jones, even though, you know, the job may be um, you know, just a fixture drain mm-hmm. stoppage or something like that, right. that may not have the priority of a leaking water heater, mm-hmm. the member still gets the priority correct in, in the triage because they've already proven they've opened their wallet right and they've opened their wallet to pay for this for this extra service correct so that now bottom line, they, oh. they've opened their wallet to you they right. trust you so the odds of them spending money with you is highly likely right. but also you can let mrs jones if you do have a, a leaking water heater or some big right. ticket item on there even though she is a member you can say mrs jones um we can get you in at you know whatever time but one is you know we do have an emergency call that would you mind if we move them first or whatever and if she says no i'm a member and i i went first then by all means right um most of the time they're going to be pretty flexible so yeah exactly mm-hmm. and then we and then we also had there was no service call fee Correct. I that that was that, a, that was our one thing. Yes. So you know, as we we talk about this as well. We you know I have a diagnostic fee, mm-hmm. all right, a forty nine dollar diagnostic fee. But we waive that if we do any work whatsoever. Mm-hmm. Well, with the members, there was no. We would come out. There, there was, right. You know. However, 
always make sure you still show it on the invoice, right? Yes. Don't just uh -huh. give them the free service call fee and they don't see it. Always, always, always show it. So for, on a member, you know, whatever work you do, um, you need to have a task somewhere in your in your field management software that um, a waived diagnostic fee, members waived diagnostic fee, right. value of $49, $79, whatever yours is. But then in the unit price, it is zero because Mrs. Jones wants to see when she gets something for free. Right. Because if she doesn't see it, it doesn't exist. Exactly. Mm -hmm. All right. And so those are the things that we had you know, on our, mm -hmm. uh, you know, on our, uh, our attaboy assurance, assurance program, program, right? Mm -hmm. So then back to the, you know, the power of the, um, the, the whole house inspection, mm -hmm. you know, you're going to find something. And so we talk with, you know, you're going to find one something, mm -hmm. okay. One something, you know, as you go through the list mm -hmm. and you, you mentioned that, because that's, you know, historically what well, was just an easy thing to do because we don't think about it. Um, replacing, you know, emergency yeah. stops, mm -hmm. you know, supply valves, mm -hmm. um, resetting toilets, you know, those kinds of things. Mm -hmm. So, you know, we had guys that were great at the toilet reset, setting all the toilets in the house, offering that up. Mm -hmm. And and we had guys that were very comfortable with the stops. They could talk that either one. Right. But you're going to find those kinds of things. Mm -hmm. All right. And you're going to pick one. Okay. You know, we, we talk about this in, um, you know. In the um, Success Academy. Right. Mm -hmm. With, uh, you know, service sales. You know, we're, we're not all about selling. You don't have to sell. There are customers already sold. Right. But, um, you know, we can freak them out when we're off, you know, we're throwing all these different things and out. Bundling and, and all bundling. the things. Right. Right. So we want to just offer the one. So mm -hmm. even in the whole house inspection, inspection, you're going to find one thing. Right. Well, you're right. going to find one thing that you're really talking about. Now, if right. you've got it, hopefully within your field management software as well, you've got some sort of inspection report right. that you check off, you know, and, and grade right. things or whatever. And then she gets a copy of that, but you're not going to hit her with all the things that's on that list. Right. right. So pick right. out something that is, that could could possibly be a problem or something that she needs to be made aware of as soon as possible. Right. The the uh, the, the temptation is to you know, try to sell them your you know your super duper water softener mm -hmm. or upsell them in the water heater that kind of stuff. Mm -hmm. Again, we get into you got to the guys have to be a good salesman and we're not the guys aren't going to be a good salesman no matter right. how much it's, I mean so we want to systemize this. for the most part yes right mm -hmm. so you know. Um, we found we, we got great, a great percentage, you know, 30 to 40% would take the, the offer. Now that's a high number. I mean, it may sound like a lot, mm -hmm. not, not a lot, but that's no, a that's, lot. That's it adds, a lot. adds up yeah. of, you know, replacing the stops, mm -hmm. all the stops in the house right. or, or resetting all the toilets. Mm -hmm. Okay. And you're going to do the same kind of thing. We provide three options. Mm -hmm. You're going to go through that process. Correct. But that's, that's the power of that. Getting right. back in and do that whole house inspection. Exactly. Okay. You get that, you know, that, that repeat sales opportunity. Mm -hmm. Very, very, very powerful. Uh -huh. All right. Hey, we got one more. I'll get the third item here in just a moment, but I have something for you for just joining me, as you know. All right. Mm -hmm. That's my million dollar plumber blueprint. Okay. You want to point for those that are watching a video? There we go. All right. All right. In it, I lay out the exact specs you need to have <laughs> to build a successful, <laughs> self-sustaining and very profitable plumbing business. All right. Kind of and a Vanna White thing. Oh, you look better mm -hmm. in Vanna White. Oh. All right. And it's free. <laughs> Did I mention that? Free. Free. It's free. All mm -hmm. right. Simply go to the <laughs> million dollar plumber dot com forward slash free. Mm -hmm. Okay. Or you can go just to the site itself, mm -hmm. million dollar plumber. Mm -hmm. Okay. Plumber and there's com. a site. Yeah. And you can somewhere on there. A, right. Yeah. All right. Have a drink of your water. Yeah. My cup. Go ahead. Are you are you parched? I'm a little parched. You're parched. All right. <laughs> all right. Grab your free copy. All right. Do it. Mm -hmm. Okay. There we go. Thank you for listening. Yeah. All right. And on that note, mm -hmm. all right, if you like what you're here, please share. Oh, please, yes. Please I was going to say, but yeah, before we dive back in, we do want to say, oh, sorry, I'm going to cough. Sorry, guys. <clears throat> please share this um, episode or go follow us out on social media. We've got a lot of great content out on social media, um, all the places, YouTube, Facebook, in the, the gram, right? Insta. Yeah, yeah, I don't yeah, know what it's called. Um, we're even on TikTok. Did you know that? TikTok? We are on TikTok. <sighs> I don't dance. Go, do we? <laughs> no, we don't dance. And so, um, yeah, or if you're grind. interested. <laughs> I'm not going to grind on TikTok. Please don't do that. The million um, dollar plumber don't grind. And he don't do that for sure. He counts money. <laughs> <laughs> but not on TikTok. So anyway, um, go out and follow us on social media. Um, all kinds of great conversations out there as well. Right. Okay. There we go. Mm -hmm. Do it. All right. So there we go. We're talking maintenance agreements here. Maintenance mm -hmm. agreements that sell. Okay. What, you know, what, what is a maintenance agreement? All right. It's not about taking care of the equipment though. That's what you're doing. Right. Okay. Um, really it's about, it's a sales tool. Right. Okay. Yep. And also it's a, re a repeat sales opportunity because mm -hmm. you're going to have back them there, in their house, back in their house. Okay. Mm -hmm. All right. And then finally, and it, this is important. All right, gang. All right. Hear me on this. Keep 
it complicated. Oh. <laughs> all right. No, we tend to want to make these things all complicated. Like, mm-hmm. you know, we got to cover all the bases and mm-hmm. say, every, keep it simple. Super simple. Okay. It su- shouldn't be this long legally legal no, you uh, where you have to hire three attorneys to write all the you know, whatever. Right. Legalese. And when you start, you know, speaking, you try to cover all everything, you know, dot every I, cross every T, you, do, you, know, you get you get wrapped up in that and it starts sounding like, you know, small print. Right. And a customer doesn't trust that. Nope. You want to make it as easy as possible for the customer to say, yeah, I'll take that savings. Sure. Right. Savings? I'll right. Like, that, that, that's mm-hmm. all they see is the, the savings. Right. And oh, oh yeah, you're going to check out. Okay. Oh, okay. That's nice. Mm-hmm. All right. As soon as you start saying, that, you know, you got to do this and then if you don't do this, jump you do through that, this hoop you got to jump right back. Or if you have different levels, you know, you got mm-hmm. your silver, gold, platinum, mm-hmm. super duper maintenance agreement. Yeah. That, that just freaks them out. Yeah. Okay. There's, there's too much that this is not a place where you want uh, options. Okay. <laughs> you know, we're big on the options, but not in service agreements. Mm-hmm. No, no, no options. Okay. Nice just, just have it basic. Mm-hmm. Okay. Straightforward. And you don't need to have a sheet that they sign or anything like that. Mm-hmm. You can make it a task. Right. Right. Like task, task right in your, your task field, line. Right, right. Right in your field management software, service Titan, House Call Pro, whatever you use, yep. have, have it right in there. And the information is all right there. So when they, they agree to get it, they're I, I right. think if I remember right, you, they sign, yep, that's what I want. Um and just all you know, the information's kind of bullet point there. It's, it's yeah. And we we did we got we so lots of them. I mean, because you just make it simple, okay? Mm-hmm. You don't have to get, you know, again, where you're have, have all these different levels and what if they you know, they got a tank list and we got to do this or that. It's just like, an, you know, figure your, 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 um, your maintenance agreement on worst case of whatever it takes to flush right. the water heater, you know, <clears throat> that kind of stuff. Mm-hmm. Okay. That's, that's just figure you're covering all that. Right. Okay. Mm-hmm. And all that, we, you know, next question, what, what do I charge and, you mm-hmm. know, for that. Um, we found the best and we really like this mm-hmm. that we didn't just do a one, you know, first of all, um, you know, to do it, you know, it's three hundred and sixty-five dollars mm-hmm. or whatever. That's the mm-hmm. savings. You know, the, all of a sudden, saving a hundred dollars. I got to spend three hundred sixty-five dollars to save a hundred dollars, mm-hmm. or even fifty dollars, or whatever. It doesn't. It doesn't seem like a value there. Mm-hmm. Okay, that doesn't work. What we liked was we had a, a monthly charge, just mm-hmm. a monthly part of being part of the membership. Right. right. Automatically charged. So you didn't have to call every time to go th- get the credit card. Right. right? Just the credit card. Or so recurring that's, right. payment. Right. Mm-hmm. Just a recurring payment. Mm-hmm. And and the price that we found is was best was 1995. Correct. Now yeah. take, keep in mind that this was, you know, hundred years ago. hundred years. Right. <laughs> what was it? Six. Or, well, when we had our plumbing business, you know, the six or seven years ago. So maybe up a little bit, but a, a small fee that doesn't sound like it's, a lot. It sounds right. like, but well, it's, it's a no brainer. Yeah, it's, it still has value. There's mm-hmm. still something there. So it's not, it's not nine. Like, that's what said. It wasn't nine ninety five, no. which sound like it was, you know, mm-hmm. which is you, you want to make it where it's really not noticeable on their, their credit card, mm-hmm. but it's not like high. Like I'm feeling like I'm paying nine, nine dollars a month for something I may never use Correct. or, or save. I mean, mm-hmm. and then even that 1995, we got into, you know, we had people that bought memberships and went with the price, you know, for putting in a, a faucet because mm-hmm. it saved them $40. Right. Mm-hmm. You know, because it was only 1995 that they paid for, but they saved $40. Correct. Um, mm-hmm. And so that's the kind of the way to look at mm. maintenance agreement for the charge of the maintenance agreement is not the money maker. Right. Okay. Mm-hmm. The money maker is establishing a relationship, a customer who's now committed to you because they're paying you extra money. Right. To get to, you know, to have a relationship with you right. and then you're getting back in their house. Okay. Mm-hmm. That's, that's the value. That's right. where you're going to make money. And you want to make sure too, within your um, field management software to tag them some way um, as a maintenance um, agreement for us again, at a boy assurance member so that right. you can also do mailings, right? Cause you're getting everybody's email address. I hope, I hope, I hope. Yes. Um, and so you can do different mailings that are specifically for members. So you want to, you know, Maybe offer some sort of savings or some sort of special or or something, right? Where it it um it kind of sets them in a VIP status. Right. Yes. Right. Right. And we even use, well even on like um we have slow days. Mm-hmm. You 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 will have if you haven't already have slow times. <laughs> I mean it's just the reality of, right. of business, right? Mm-hmm. Well, we'd have we'd send out to our members, right? 
And so as your member list builds, you know. Special announcement for our members. For our, just a special opportunity for our members. Mm -hmm. All right. 20% off today. Right. If, if you. Typically you know, give 15, offer right, 20. Right. right. You know, that, that kind of a thing. Mm -hmm. All just, but you know, they don't need to know necessarily know you were slow or whatever. It doesn't right. matter if they do know you're slow. It doesn't, doesn't matter. Doesn't matter. Mm -hmm. It's just that they feel that they, they're getting a special opportunity. Right. right. And right. everyone wants to feel like a VIP. Right. So if they've paid, if they're paying into something, um, just to constantly remind them, they may not go with whatever e you know, email special that you, that you send out, but they, they see it and they're reminded, oh yeah, I'm a VIP. I'm a VIP at right. Attaboy or whatever. Right. right. Mm -hmm. You know, so, so it's great. Mm -hmm. You know, and another thing we did, yeah. um, which, which really worked with, uh, with our guys, I shared the, uh, the, the monthly fee. Mm -hmm. So it incentivized our guys to build, to, to sell these, to mm -hmm. kind of push them. What I mean by share, you know, we did ours in 1995. I gave the guys 10 bucks. Mm -hmm. So a guy gets 10 bucks every month. Every month. Every right. month. Yeah. So, and you can set that up in your field management software right. as well. Mm -hmm. So imagine a guy who, who, you know, it's not difficult to get to a hundred mm -hmm. of, of these maintenance agreements. Right. So what is that a month? I don't know. Thousand bucks. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Is that right? Yeah. No, times 10. Yeah. Thousand sure. bucks, mm -hmm. which we had got, you know, you're getting a thousand, fifteen hundred, two thousand, three. I mean, X, I mean, right. the guy's getting that mm -hmm. because he, as long as they're employed. So, so for as long as they're employed. Mm -hmm. So it helps kind of retain. It's tough for guys to walk away when they're getting that kind of extra money as mm -hmm. well. All right. So mm -hmm. again, the, the idea, and, you know, and you can say, well, I don't want to give it to the guy. They're not the ones paying. What? Well, <laughs> it, the, the, that fee right there is not the money maker. Mm -hmm. Okay. The fee is establishing the relationship and then, you know, getting back in the house. Correct. And then also right. what happens right. is when the, the plumber um, is hopefully you're sending the same plumber out and because they're building a relationship, the plumber wants to serve that customer even better and even more because they know what it means to their pocket as well, right? They're getting um, a spiff off of it. So right. they're going to want to make sure they really take care of Mrs. Jones. Exactly. Mm -hmm. And so we also had an opportunity, we kind of looked at it to where it was an, an opportunity for the plumber to build like their own clientele. Mm -hmm. So we did, we, it, there was some, we didn't guarantee, you couldn't guarantee <laughs> that, me. that, you know, that, um, their customer that they sold their, um, the, the maintenance agreement to, you know, they would always be the only one serving that customer, but it would help. you drinking my water. you drinking all my water up. Mm -hmm. That's all right, baby. Sorry, honey. Okay. Parched. All right. <laughs> <laughs> it, but, but, you know, you had those slow times when it was slow and then Mrs. Jones called and Joe was the, was the one that sold them, mm -hmm. you know, then Joe got to go on that call. Correct. Right. Mm -hmm. and so they did kind of build their clientele. Absolutely. Right? Mm -hmm. So. So maintenance no. agreements. Maintenance agreements. Mm -hmm. Is it good? Should you have them? Yes. Yes, you should. Okay. Mm -hmm. You need to use them in the right way. Mm -hmm. All right. It ain't about plumbing. <laughs> it ain't about taking care of the equipment. Okay. It's a, it's a sales tool. Mm -hmm. All right. Okay. It's a, it's a tool to get back in the house. All right. And bottom line, keep it simple. Mm -hmm. Keep it silly, simple. Kiss it. Kiss it. Keep it simple, stupid. <laughs> okay. I know it's a harsh way of putting it. I like to, right? <laughs> all right. There you go. Maintenance agreements. Mm -hmm. Good stuff there. And we talk about that also in more detail within. The Success Academy. Good transition. I know. I'm Very a, good. I'm a segue gal. All right. Hey, check out the Success Academy. All right. In it, we teach you everything you need to know about building, growing, scaling, all right. Making money mm -hmm. with your plumbing business, ultimately creating a freedom lifestyle. Mm -hmm. Okay. It's all laid out there for you. 12 bite-sized modules. We cover everything from maintenance agreements, mm -hmm. branding, branding, uh, marketing, field service management software, hiring, mm -hmm. firing. Mm -hmm. All right. Accounting. That's not very fun. Yes, you know, yes. there are but some parts of it, you, you got to know it. it. You got to okay? know it. All right how to charge what you need to charge. Mm -hmm. Okay. You're getting, we're building your own flat rate pricing, your own flat rate book. Okay. Those and kinds at the of, very, one of the very last modules, we talk about how to live the freedom lifestyle. So, which is what this is all about. Okay. You just don't want to own your job. You just right. don't want to be a, have a job. Mm -hmm. You want to have a job, go get a job. Right. All right. This You're building a plumbing business to, yeah, to, to build an asset. Mm -hmm. All right. That provides the life you desire for you and your family. Correct. All right. There we go. go check, so wait, check it out. 14 day free trial still. You still doing that? Yep. So go to the million Sucker. dollar, <laughs> the million dollar still plumber. Still away for free for yep. 14 days. Million dollar plumber.com oh, forward okay. slash success. Do it. Mm -hmm. Check it out. All yeah. right. There you go. Mm -hmm. Okay. Hey, great, great episode. episode. Oh, yep. Jinx, you owe me soda. All right. Okay. Mm -hmm. I'll pay you later. <laughs> all right. Maintenance agreements. So, all right. Okay. Hey, before I let you go. As always, I want to remind you that you were purposefully and wonderfully created, and you were created to do great things. So, plumb like a champion. <laughs> Bye-bye, everybody.